Bishop de la Peña. Narinig po natin kanina, sinabi ni Padre Chito, what inspired him to become a priest is because of the role of the parents he saw. They are both church leaders in their own way, sumasama siya. Tsaka yung participation niya, being sa altar, boys, you know, at nakita niya yung service to the people help a lot, no? Ngayon kayo po, Bishop, ilan po kayo magkapatid? Lima. Lima. And, and I am the only boy. Oh. You know what, El Elvira, I, I probably started much younger than Father Chito because I was already a convent boy at nine years old, no? So, uh, para akong si Samuel na inoffer kay ng kanyang parents kay Eli, na ah, the prophet. Ah, talaga. Okay. No? Uh, I grew up in that environment sa, sa kumbento ng Paris namin. And so, uh, even if I am the only boy in the family, I was able to detach myself from my, my family and uh, focus on the work that I was doing in the church. No? So, pag sisilbi ng misa, pag babating ting, uh, pag uh, linis ng kumbento, much early, uh, early in the morning. That's always the regimen is very uh, strict, like uh, we wake up at 4 o'clock, clean the convent, and get ready for mass, and so forth and so on. That's, that was the, uh, the kind of work. How long you was sa I was nine. nine. Pero Grade you two love ako, it. The Paris priest, he, okay. he, he, he loves me so much because, ano, ang, ang, ang image na nakikita, nakikita niya sa akin eh, I, I am a very good boy. Uh, uh, no, uh, 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 reliable sa mga gawaing bahay, ganyan. So, gustong gusto niya ako. And then uh, he molded me to become, to aspire to become a priest. No? Ah, so, he's a Paris uh, sa, priest. Sa grade 2, pagdating ng grade 6, sabi niya, papasok ka sa seminaryo. I said, sige, papasok ako. And my mother was very happy about it. Although my father felt, yeah, he wanted me to be an engineer. Just like <laughs> he, dream niya, uh, na hindi natupad. So mm, he wanted me to fulfill his mm -hmm. dream. Sabi ko, uh, iba iba ang ating calling. No? And, Pero yung papa mo is an engineer by himself? Hindi. Naman. Uh, he did not uh, fulfill nga his dream. Eh. Okay. He wanted me to, to, be the one. to be the one to fulfill that dream. Mm -hmm. But it's your mom. So can it you say mom. it's your mom, yung kanyang faith ang nagdala sa'yo, support niya, yung support niya sa'yo? My uncle, na, my uncle, okay. my uncle who was the um, uh, sacristan mayor ah, sa Paris, okay. so uh -huh. I, I, he was always there that, uh, encouraging uh, you. Uh, with me, uh, encouraging me, and uh, so uh, kind of uh, I looked up to him. And then uh, when I finished uh, elementary, uh, the the Paris priest wanted me to s wanted to send me to the minor seminary in Dumaguete, but uh, something happened. Uh, the new auxiliary bishop of Dumaguete, Bishop uh, Bienvenido Tutut, came one oh, summer okay. and he saw me and he said, "And so you're going to the seminary? Why don't you go to Phil Mission Seminary and become a missionary like me?" And so it came. It dawned on me that. Uh, well, I have this desire, no, uh, of being adventurous, no. I was so confined in that small island of Zikir all my life, and I wanted to see the world. You know? So, being a missionary, I had that desire to Travel. to explore uh -huh. <laughs> places and to be a missionary. Mm -hmm. And so, I accepted his offer, and he said, "You don't have to worry about your school fees. I will shoulder everything." That's. Uh, that's gave a spark in my imagination and said, yes. So he was my benefactor and uh, not knowing that uh, one day I would take his place in Marawi. Imagine how faith, no? Yes. Hindi talaga natin alam kung anong mm. gusto ng Diyos. Eh. It's only later on you come mm. to realize mm. na lahat pala, it paves the way for mm. one thing to another, di ba? Yes. So our life is full of surprises. Mm -hmm. But sometimes the surprises will only comes to know when things happen, di ba? Mm -hmm. At yeah. kung isipin natin, Padre Chito Bishop, napakaganda yung mm -hmm. nangyayari. I-recall natin, that means to say you are being well taken care of. Mm -hmm. Hindi kayo pinapabayaan. Mm -hmm. eh. Kasi mm -hmm. pareho po kayo may mission. Imagine mm -hmm. both of you were influenced by Bishop Tutud. Na alam mm -hmm. po natin mm -hmm. na matay sa cross, no? Pero mm -hmm. pinili na niya 
kung sino yung dapat pumalit sa kanya. I mean, instinct din yun. I don't know. Maybe the Holy Spirit inspire him. I don't know. And now you are sitting together, di ba? Napakaganda sharing yung Bishop Edwin and Father Chito, no? Sa experience ninyo kung bakit kayo naging pari, why you choose this kind. Pero nakikita natin, may naglilig sa inyo with the name of Bishop Tutu. May he rest in peace, no? So, dito nakikita natin na without your knowing it, faith takes a hand, no? So, and both of you loves to serve and loves to accept the challenge. So, maray pa to, po tayo uh, pag-uusapan at marami din po kami matutuhan sa, sa mga kwento ninyo. Kaya, ibabalik po namin ulit si Bishop Edwin De La Peña at Padre Chito Suganov next week dito po sa programa ng Power to Unite with Elvira. <music>